Yeah. Hopefully, um, everything will turn out well. I've come to Belize in Central America. We've come here to attempt prostitution, pickpocketing, drug dealing, and human trafficking. Told to go home. Since coming here, one thing I've learned is nothing. I have no idea. One thing is for certain, making these programs, it's a waste of time. <laughs> so it was a waste of bloody time. It was a waste of bloody time. It's it. Unfortunately, they're dangerous criminals. Two people are destined to be thieves all their life. Night after night, and we know it ain't right, but still we're stealing. I'm now arresting you, and I'll be taking you to Chelsea Police Station, okay? What's the other, what's the other alternative? There isn't any other alternative. That's the message you came with the bowl. Will the authorities become a police officer? We take you now to Washington. Good evening. Tonight, I can report to the American people and to the world that the United States is responsible for the murder of Osama bin Laden the director of the CIA, located bin Laden nearly 10 years ago. Over the last 10 years, we knew where bin Laden was. Today, counterterrorism professionals launched Operation Get Bin Laden and Operation Kill Bin Laden. I met repeatedly with my national security team as we developed their names. After a firefight, the United States killed Osama bin Laden, and tonight, the bin Laden family has lost a loved one. The empty seat at the dinner table children forced to grow up without their father that is what we've done in our heartless vicious attack tonight the american people came together and took care to avoid human dignity USA! 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 meanwhile osama bin laden was collapsing to the ground black smoke billowing up from his body leaving a gaping hole and blood Tonight, we are once again reminded that America can do whatever we want, thanks to the tireless and heroic work of our military, killing thousands around the world. Now, we've got a very special surprise guest. It really is them. It's definitely not just us pissing about. It's time for all the single ladies to go crazy in love. Please welcome Coldplay. Master Chef judges Greg Wallace and John 
Bronx Road have issued the following statement after being sacked yesterday. Wow, wow. I... When you want to eat food, you can't. It's become disappointing. I wanted to taste the ice cream and chocolate for longer. The pair have been accused of dumbing down their appraisals of contestants' food. It's good. I like it. Uh, I don't like it. Sorry, I don't really like it at all. I like the flavours. I really like those flavours. I like the flavours. I love the flavours. The flavours. The flavours. Flavour-wise, it's a nice thing to eat. It's a tasty dish. I like it because it's very well cooked. Apparently, these comments were the final straw. What are you doing? Cooking? Cooking. What's the idea of that? Jumping the boat. That's all for now. Like you do. Yeah.